Hi, I'm Zappa Debobrax. Today's world, we have a lot of creature comforts which make life a little easier. Things like, oh, having a never to walk your dog because your dog's a robot, or <laughs> never having to wash the car when it rains because it no longer rains when you wash the car. Things like this make life a little easier. And yet, life wouldn't be just so if it weren't for one person we all know about. That's right, Dr. Howard Harris. Now, you've all learned about Howard Harris in your history lessons and on your computer disks. However, I bet you not many of you know the real man. That's why today we're going on a journey to find out the true Howard Harris. Tonight, join me on my voyage into Howie, the man behind the myth. Go shopping. Oh, Africans. Eat. You really love this dress. I've seen it. It looks really good on people. Oh, damn it, they're closed. to do I should say is he loved to go to any kind of sports here we can find him at a Colts game hey Jeff George get your head out of your ass go back to school and get your education you suck god damn you shitty passer oh Mark Chaprota are you crazy third and long and you ran the ball no wonder no one shows up to this game you suck Mark Chaprota you suck god damn eat shit go 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 oh flag on the plate what the what the hell was that? Clipping! Clipping on number 32! Clipping? 
What the hell kind of call is that? Um, get your head out of your ass. You and George ought to get the fuck. <laughs> oh, damn it. Why do I cheer for the Colts? I'm going to cheer for New England now. At least they're a winning ball club. Uh oh, what is My beeper. Thank God. It couldn't be any more tragic than this. Oh, poor Howard. Little did he know that in 1996, the Colts went on to win the Super Bowl, and then for the next four years. Oh, well. How he did was chores. Any kind of chores. He loved to run around and pick up things. Uh, anyone coming? No? Hi, uh, how are you doing? Hi, how are you doing? Oh, I'm, uh, what's your name again? Tina? Tina, good. Um, I've got some clothes. Wait, Tina, I'd like to tell you a joke real quick. It's kind of a dirty one. Can I tell dirty jokes again? Sure, go ahead. Okay. Um, all right. So, uh, Mickey Mouse is at the psychiatrist. He's seeing a psychiatrist. He's having marrow problems with Minnie. And so, um, um, the doctor says, well, Mickey, uh, you know, why do you, why do you think Minnie's so crazy? Do you think she's crazy? She's not crazy? And, uh, but Mickey says, crazy? She's fucking goofy. <laughs> she was, uh, having such a goofy on the side. You know what I mean? Okay. Out of the shirt's coming. Pretty good? Pretty good. Okay, great. What's your phone number? Alright, it's 872-0807. 2524. Okay. Did you get that? Okay, that's great. Uh, have you ever called him before? I got this very empty machine message. I'm really funny on it. Okay. You like spicy food? Oh, yeah. Oh, good. Okay. Uh, let's see, well, I gotta go to Hooks after this. I'm gonna pick up some emergency gum. Or else. Just wait for the thing to go around. Dog. <laughs> oh. oh, yeah. Eight? Neat's favorite. Mm. Uh -huh. <laughs> Hi, Dr. Harris. Can I help you, please? <laughs> Give me oh, Troy, I know where everything is. Could you tell me where uh, my hair curler is? <laughs> I'm just kidding. It's right there. <laughs> So long, everybody. Bye. Bye, Mr. Harris. Another thing that Howie really likes to do is he loves to watch a good movie. Here you can find him watching the movie on the couch. <laughs> Howie is also an avid cleaner around the house. Dad! Dad! What? I had a paper here with a phone number on it. It's really important. What? Um, do you know where it is? No, Matt, I haven't seen your note. Why do you always think I take your notes and put them somewhere? <laughs> I'll just put his note with the other notes. <laughs> Jimmy, kiss, and uh, whatever. Uh, uh. Whew, that was a good one. Uh. And how he also left presents in the bathroom for the family. Another thing we have found through research that Howie used to like to do would be while Matthew or Mitchell, his sons, were downstairs Mitchell having company, they uh, trying to keep the girls busy, Howie would love to show up and yell a little something just to show off. Matthew! Matt! Matthew! Yeah, Dad! Did you uh, lock up? Be sure to lock up, okay, when you get the chance. Uh, all right, Dad. 
Hey, Dad. What? Uh, is your back getting hairier? It should be. I just saw Rhonda. Well, I hope you enjoyed our little reconstruction 200 years ago of Dr. Howard Harris's life. The man behind the myth. It was quite a man, wasn't it? Wasn't he? I think so, too. Well, <laughs> I hope you enjoy yourselves. <laughs> Next week, watch us for the year 2000 reconstruction when we see the rise of Eric Estrada to presidency. Thanks. <laughs>